Hi Aquarius, welcome back to my channel Love Stories. Today I am going to do your online psychic love reading for the month of August. Keep in mind that these readings are general. This may be resonant with you and may be not resonant with each and every one of you. If it resonates with you, take guidance from these readings and if it not resonant with you, you can simply ignore it. Let's get started. What are the... Wow. What are the Aquarius person's feeling, thinking and intentions towards... Aquarius, what are the Aquarius person's feeling, thinking and intentions towards Aquarius? What are the Aquarius person's feeling, thinking and intentions towards Aquarius? And we are having here King of Sword, Three of Cups, Tower. What are the Aquarians feeling, thinking and intentions towards this person? What are the Aquarians feeling, thinking and intentions towards this person? What are the Aquarians feeling, thinking and intentions towards this person? And we are having here Five of Cups, The Lovers, Judgment, Death. What are the mutual energies? Eight of Wands, The Empress. These are your cards and signs that could relate to your person. Scorpio with this death. Capricorn with this uh, lovers, Cancer Scorpio Pisces with this five of cups, three of cups, Gemini Libra Aquarius with five of sword, king of sword, Aries Leo Sagittarius with this eight of wands, Aquarius with the star card. Aquarius with this five of sword, your person, there is a conflict between you two, fight between you two and the reason is just you know enjoying with friends and family. Some kind of you know third person, third reason, and uh, party mood. Something happen, and this person is disagree with you, and then it's converted into fight, disagreement, conflicts. You guys are having like giving me let, let me give you an analogy. You guys are having fun together with friends, family, with each other. But something is just you know happened between you two because of someone else. Or maybe because of your own things and uh, there is a fight and conflict between you two this is this kind of you know things happens and uh, a shock you give this person a major shock a big shock that's why this person is just you know mad angry you give this person shock and maybe there is a third party between you two and this person is really cold and strict towards you they can feel your coldness, you know, they also cold towards you. They are cold, they are strict, they are straightforward, they are not, you know, showing any kind of compassion, passion, nothing, just strict and straightforward. Calculative, because you give them shock. And every person, uh, you know, react differently. This person gets shocked and become cold. And you know the reason enjoying having fun and then it turned into really just fight and bad so there is a bad uh, fight uh, a conflict between you two a beautiful thing it turned into a really bad experience conflict and fight between you two you regretting over something I think something happened at your behalf I think you are regretting over past uh, you are looped in your past. You think I shouldn't do that, and uh, you are grieving and regretting, and uh, you are not all okay with this fight. It's not just pre-planned thing. It just happened. It just suddenly happened. You are no intentions. You are, you don't have any intentions to hurt this person or pick up a fight with this person, but somehow things happens uh, out of our control. You know we can't take responsibilities for things. For those things that we can't control so it's not your you know thing it's not nothing to do with you don't you know, don't you know uh, regret and you know in a loop and in grieving because <laughs> because things happen so you know you, you are in some kind of regrets and you want uh, some kind of uh, you know table talk with this person we should talk with this uh, we should try to sort it out but there is ending something is transformed something is right now this fight converted into a big ending like a big transformation 
you want second chance you want to fix this you you realize that some kind of realization in you you realize that if you know this a bad thing happened between us something bad happened between us you totally realize that it's whose fault and all that you totally realize everything the all circumstances and you want to talk to this person you want this person to give each other second chance but there is a you know a ending you may be giving this ending maybe this person giving you ending but something is transformed and it's a blessed connection something uh, things a really beautiful blessed connection we are going really nice we are together for you know year and we are really fine we are happy with each other and suddenly something happened and there is choices in front of us what should i do now be with this person do something else you know the ending the transformation the choices the regrets and uh, something happens is just out of your control this is a major arcana combination three card things you can't blame yourself you can't blame yourself for things that you can't control things happens you realize that so yeah something bad happens between us but we can try to fix it but this is happening it's nothing to do with you it's just you know things fate and destiny and there is a fast communication between you two maybe you talk to this person and uh, you know you try to you know sort out things and you are in your empress uh, energy when you are radiant conscious caring trying to be calm, calm you know trying to be calm and relaxed because you are kind and you are this radiant you trying to you know in your this you are in this you know your humble and nurturing and motherly and kind nature and you are trying to talk to this person try to fix the situation with your kindness and with your beautiful energies Let's see what else we have for you, Aquarius. What's the outcome? We are hanging here. Hierophant, Seven of Cups, and Three of Wands. With this Hierophant, there is, you know, a com this is conflict about the commitment and marriage and, uh, you know, long run. Something about that. this is about i think your connection with this person is really you guys together it's it's a really you know long and you trust each other you committed to each other this is a committed relationship but there is a fight something happened in this committed relationship and confusion a lot of confusion in front of you you don't know how to fix this situation a lot of choices in front of you you are just analyzing this person from distance and there is a distance between you two and you want to travel toward this person you are you are just you plan a lot of uh, you know things with this person you plan your whole future with this person how can this person just you know uh, you know fight with you and try to you know uh, the push you away and but this conflict this shock you give this person some kind of shock and this person is just angry cold and uh, you know uh, fighting with you disagree with you reason there is, already you guys are in a committed relationship and you are confused here you don't know what should you do about the situation and you are analyzing sometimes you want to you should travel toward this person you should talk to this person but you are right now analyzing this situation and analyzing your position analyzing this person's position trying to understand things right now you analyzing everything let's see what else we have for you aquarius what else we have for you? aquarius and we are having here the star queen of sword and nine of wands only one thing wishing this person is wishing it's going to be fine you are wishing it's going to be fine you are trying to have a gut balance you try to you know peace you try to you know just let it whatever happening just let it just wait for a right moment wait for the right time give it, giving it time and wishing it's going to be fine and you are just strict toward this person you also become a little bit strict you are not going to take any kind of bs from this person and you are a little bit strict toward this person this person is cold you are also queen of sword toward this person both of you cold and strict and giving each other lessons uh, giving each other cold uh, tough uh, treatment but in all this you know giving each other treatment lesson you know try to being tough and cold with each other you you somehow trigger each other's bad memories then you guys in the past as i told you you guys are in a committed relationship 
and there is something happen and there is a fight and conflict between you two and this committed relationship reason may be third party or maybe you with your own thing your guys being ha- you guys having fun and this turn into a bad thing you trigger each other's bad memories when you you know when we fight with a person our person we somehow it's happened it's, it's psyche we think about all the bad things happens in the past which we did each other to, to each other so it's you know it's a painful situation but you know how to deal with that you will get through with this okay let's see what else we have for you what you and want to add i bring you a message from your descended loved one i am happy at peace and i love you very much please don't worry about me okay let's see what advice messages pray to the god for peace in your life enjoy life let her let him go spend some time with your mother for now let it go these are few advice messages in the end summary of your reading is there is a fight between you two entertainment enjoyment a party turn into a fight and conflict and you guys are giving each other lessons something happens it out, out of your control you can't blame yourself for things that you can't control you guys trigger each other's bad memories and there is a fight and conflict between you two these are some these are few readings of this helpful for you thank you god bless you bye